Today, students will officially head back to the classroom in Clay County. That's after a decision was made to push the start date back by a week due to coronavirus concerns. News 10's Jordan Kudes joins us live this morning from Northview High School in Brazil. She has more on opening day just hours before students return. Well, John Alia, for the first time in months, those doors to the schools will reopen. Now, students won't just be needing their backpack this year, but they'll also need to make sure they're wearing a mask, as that will be one of the requirements heading back to the classroom. Now, you may remember that schools were actually supposed to open up last week, but a last minute decision changed things. That's when the superintendent cited a rise in COVID 19 cases. So, in collaboration with the health department, they decided to wait a few. Few days for the opening bell. Now, as I mentioned before, during classroom hours, students will be expected to wear those face masks, sanitize, and of course, remain socially distant. Jeffrey Fritz told us he was disappointed to push back the schools by the week, but ultimately decided that it was the safer option. Now, this is just one of the few schools that are actually opening up, but if you'd like to see a list of the other schools that are opening their doors and who is closed for right now, you can head over to our website. That's WTHITV.com. Reporting live in Clay County, Jordan Kudish, News 10.